I thought through that answer a lot. It's like, well, how do you judge someone's belief? By what they say or by what they do? And that just starts the philosophical argument. It's another example of the fact that it's very difficult for us to rationally defend evolved institutions because they weren't exactly constructed on the basis of rational argument. They, they emerged across time, like marriage emerged across time, all these institutions. It wasn't like a central planning committee sat down and thought them through precisely. And so we don't have an articulated defense at hand. I, I think the reason people don't like your, uh, on either side of the argument, maybe don't like your answer is because they want to get at the question of faith. And they're trying to make you answer that right, question. But they have a misconception so about what constitutes faith. Like I can give you an example. So you might say, well, faith means that you believe things that can't be empirically demonstrated. 